for the final child support payment and Virginia dad was eager to take it to the child, but not in the form of a dollar bill. He pulled up in front of the house in a trailer dumping truck and turned it around. The ex-wife came out to ask what was being dumped on her yard. At that time, she didn't know who it was. He yelled out and said, it's your final child support payment and proceeded to dump 80,000 pennies on the grass. Let's watch the clip and we'll talk about it. Family got a shocking delivery on their lawn last month. Crime Insider John Burkett explains why 80,000 pennies were put on their lawn and how they're using the money to help those in need. What looked like a landscaping trailer dropped a pile of pennies in front of a window mailbox last month. A deep run graduate says it's been hard trying to make sense of it. If a penny is worth a thousand words. I just turned 18. Certainly 80,000 of the coins will help Avery Sanford tell her side of the story. When I was in the middle of class, my dad came by. Um, he had rented a trailer. The Deep Run senior will spend the summer at home before venturing to Virginia Tech for her freshman year. He pulled up in front of our house, like turned the trailer on, so it dumped out all the pennies in the street in front of our house. And my mom walked outside while it was happening. She didn't recognize him at first. And she asked, what are you dumping on my lawn? And he said, it's your final child support payment. And that's when she realized who it was. Now we're thinking she'd have to use a snow shovel in the summer to scoop up some domestic drama. It's not just her that he'd be trying to embarrass. It's also me. It's also my sister. And it's upsetting that he doesn't really consider that before he did this. Once the pennies were picked up, Sanford and her mom decided to flip the script. Her mom donating her daughter's last child support payment, every penny, to Safe Harbor. Safe Harbor is a center that supports those who are experiencing or have experienced domestic violence, sexual violence, or human trafficking. Since the incident, Safe Harbor has experienced a spike in donations. The mom reported the incident to the police and admitted his gesture was 18 years worth of frustration that got the best of him. So it seems like there were a lot of problems going on that she was aware of. So let me know in the comments. Have you heard about this story? Experienced this story? Let me know your thoughts. And as always, thank you for listening. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.